Hi, this is Scott, a product manager with CloudWord, and in just five minutes, I'm going to show you how to integrate WordPress and Google Sheets with ease. If you've ever used Google Form Builder or similar tools, you know that they can be cool to use, but they have limitations. You are stuck with their theme, and you can't really do anything with the data once you collect it. Obviously, that doesn't work in a world of responsive web pages, mobile apps, and cloud computing. What you want is programmatic control and all the capabilities of a database, but with the ease you get from spreadsheets and HTML. That's where CloudWord comes in. In this 5-minute challenge, I'm going to show you how to integrate your WordPress app with Google Sheets using the Ease framework. We will not only create a form, we will build a functional contacts management app. So let's go! So let's start by installing the Ease Framework. Download the free Ease Framework plugin from cloudword.com or wordpress.org. Activate your plugin and continue on to Ease Settings. We now need to connect with Google Drive. To do this, we need to create a Google Cloud project. Any name will do. Your Google Cloud project contains the Google settings and authentication needed by your WordPress app to access Google Drive. Basically, we are setting up your username and password for your app. Add the project ID you created to the Ease setting wizard and click Next. Our first setting is to activate Google's Drive API. Set Drive API to On. Drive API is used by your app to access Google Drive. Our next step in the wizard is to create the client ID that is used for authorization of your app with Google Drive. From the wizard, click to open the Google page and click Create Client ID. From the text box, copy the authorized JavaScript origins URL from the wizard to the same field on Google's Create Client ID page. Next, do the same thing for the authorized redirect URI and click Create Client ID. Now that you've created the client ID, copy the client ID back to the eSettings wizard. Copy the client secret to the wizard. Click Save Changes. Back in the Cloud Console on the API and Auth Consent screen setup, make sure there is an email address and product name set. Last, set your permalink settings to post name. You can use any permalink setting, but be sure to update the links in your new pages. Creating our contacts management app is as simple as creating a new page. Use the script helper for Ease Templates. Select the contacts template collection. Pages are made up of HTML with simple Ease tags to access Google Sheets. Select to create all pages in this collection. Creating the collection creates a page for each template in the collection. In our case, we have three new pages, but we are most interested in editing and listing contacts. Open up List Contacts for an Ease preview. Ease kicks off with a Start List block and is followed by a Header and Row block to process results. It's just that easy. Let's run our app. First, allow access to Google Drive for your app when prompted. Running the edit page, let's add a contact. This page is an HTML form. You can use form validations and any input type. Form actions are handled by ease, so no need to write server code. Adding your first row will also create a sheet if one does not exist.
Create button will add a row and take you to the list page. Our list page is formatted as a table, but you can format your returned rows any way you like. To modify our row, we link back to the edit page that has ease, edit, and delete form actions as well, making it truly easy to create a data management app. To see the results, head over to Google Drive and check out our new sheet. Thank you for joining our 5-Minute Challenge. To learn more about Ease, go to cloudword.com.